It's called Antelope Island, and even though there are antelope on the island, the biggest draw is no doubt the bison. And with the calving season having just finished, a lot of people are heading out to see all the baby bison. But as new specialist Alex Cabro explains, the state is once again putting out the don't get too close to the animals. I think I live in the wrong air. I no matter how many times he has seen them, Arnie Van Wagner can't get enough of them. I love wild animals. But he doesn't dare get close to a bison. Oh, I wouldn't go up to them. They're bigger than I am. <laughs> Even though they're lazy and slow, oh, dude. the internet is full of videos of people who thought the same thing. They just don't care. Like They tell you even up at Yellowstone not to mess with anything, but they do. And with the busy holiday weekend coming up, managers at Antelope Island State Park know a lot of people will be visiting because of the bison. So the warning is um, to not approach bison, right? So we ask folks, I know Yellowstone says 25 yards. We just try to extend that and we're just like, let's consider a football field. Maybe don't approach closer than that. People have been seriously hurt because they were too close to bison. There are several warning signs on the island, but managers see people approaching them almost every day. Oh yeah, yeah, all the time. Van Hadley lives nearby and uses his park pass to visit the island several times a month. He remembers one incident. A guy who's standing on the field taking a picture and bison's charging him and He's running like crazy. We didn't know what to do. He finally do dove into his car and got out. This is video of another man who was hiking at Antelope Island when a bison charged him. Fortunately, the man got away and wasn't hurt, but it's an example of how fast the animals can move and why park managers are asking everyone to be careful. We're threats to them, and so if they feel threatened by us and if they don't feel like there's a good ex escape for them, then they'll they'll come after us uh, to protect themselves. Park managers say it is okay to get out of your car to look at the bison and take pictures of them, just stay near your car. Now, if a bison turns its head and it looks at you, that means you are too close. And if it cocks its tail, you're definitely too close. The best advice, just don't get near them. At Antelope Island, Alex Cabrero, KSL 5 News.